Hello and welcome to my channel, Boo Snakes and More. Today we're going to be talking about Sega. So please like this video and subscribe to the channel. And for more videos like this, watch my other house channel, A New Snakes and Stuff. My youngest son's channel, He Needs Toys and Games. Or my oldest son's channel, Little Chris 10. Now let's dive into the video. Sega Sammy Holdings has reached an agreement to acquire Stock Logic, an in Haven, Netherlands based online gambling company. The move will set Sega back around $141 million. This being one of the largest MA deals in its history. Stack Logic runs a B2B oriented online gambling platform essentially offering a backbone for a variety of digital casinos. Since its founding in 2014, the Dutch company has expanded to over 20 million market and currently employs more than 550 staffers across seven offices. Sega has now opted to acquire Stack Logic, having confirmed as much in a July 26 notice to investors for the Japanese gaming giant characterized the deal as part of an ongoing effort to booster its gambling operations while Sega already runs a successful pinko business. That branch of the company is predominantly domestic and non-digital. In contrast, The Struck Logic deal is meant to help it capture a share of the lucrative sports betting and online casino market in the United States, which is currently estimated to generate $16.5 in annual revenue. That venture is driven by only seven U.S. states in which online betting or gaming is presently legal. Stock Logic currently has a license to operate in three of them, Rhode Island, Pennsylvania, and Michigan. The Dutch company also has plans to expand to even more states. With Sega, this hoping that this deal will help it capture a sizable share of the growing U.S. iGaming market. The accusation is valued at approximately 130 million pounds, 141.33 million, which is roughly 8.5 times Stack Logic's annual revenue. The final sale price will be adjusted based on the Dutch Group's working capital, net debt, and other factors that are yet to be disclosed. But the deal's starting valuation is already well above all of the company's past M&A moves, except for Sega's 2023 acquisition of Revivo, which was priced at approximately $776 million. Stack Logic is also the first non-video game developer, developer that Sega has acquired in nearly two decades. Its first and only previous purchase of this kind was that of Entertainment Center Gameworks, which was completed in May 2005. As for the deer at hand, the Stack Logic acquisition is planned to be wrapped up during the first quarter of Sega's next physical year, i.e., between April and June 2025. The deal will mark Sega's 11th accusation to date. The iGaming sector isn't the only industry that the Japanese company is currently pursuing with the goal of diversifying its operations. To that end, Sega has lately also been investing in movie and TV adaptions of its proper, popular IPs through most the most of those projects have yet to see the light of day. 
Thank you for watching this video and peace out to the next one.